Hello, welcome to Kalen's Game Corner. Today's fact of the day is, in the original Pokemon Red and Blue, Charizard cannot learn the move Fly, however, Dodrio can. Anyways, on to the video. Sup, nerds, we're back! We're playing more Cassette Beasts! So, uh, yeah. Man, I'm already falling back on the so yeah. Man, that really does bode well for the recording session, doesn't it? Uh-oh! Uh, if you haven't been tuning into my Pokemon Radical Red live streams, which, uh, considering this has been getting more views than them, there's a real chance you're not, uh, do that. Why? Because I told you so, and I am God. No, but, uh, because it, it's a fun time on the stream. We have lots of fun. You know, if you, if you like these types, if you like this type of game, you'd probably like that, too. Uh, something, something, like, subscribe. Nailed it. But, uh, also... It's funny, right? Because I'm using more of a balanced team in this playthrough of Radical Red. Uh, but I used to always just play hyper offense on Pokemon. And my logic was always, oh, well, it's just easier. And the issue is, it's not actually easier at all. It's just simpler. And what would always end up happening is, yeah, I'm playing a brain dead strategy, but what? But I, I just the performance is never actually good because you run into an opponent that has any sort of ability to survive an attack from your Pokemon, and hyper offense falls apart. So what I'm saying is, you gotta try multiple strategies in these types of games. I mean, right now, honestly, I'm feeling kind of weak because my monsters aren't all that strong. Uh, probably not, like, right now, but definitely sometime, either during this recording session or the next, I'm going to have to stop to level grind. Just, not just for, like, character levels, but to get stronger monsters. Because, like, you know, Kaylee's Sirenade is super weak just hasn't been accomplishing much so I'd really like to get it remastered to its evolved form I've been trying to uh, actually have things to talk about other than just the game itself because what I've figured out Wait. is just talking about the game I'm playing gets really boring really fast if there isn't anything interesting going on so that's, uh, that's what I'm trying to work on. Get a little bit better at that, you know? Uh, speaking of talking about the game I'm playing, because I'm not going to practice what I literally just said I would do, uh, uh, the, that 1.2 update I was talking about before is out now, which is cool. It adds a few new monsters. Uh, mostly evolutions to guys already in the game, but it's still pretty neat. Don't know if I'm going to use any of them, but they're pretty cool looking. Actually, uh, Diveal here, the, the seal monster, actually got a secondary evolved form to pick from. Which is really cool if you, uh... If you don't like the, the normal one. I might use the new one just because it's new, honestly. And also because it still gets plenty of water attacks, even though it becomes an ice type. Man, this Pyromelian really has had its attack stats ruined, huh? Well, uh, I've been trying to record a bit of a backlog, so then hopefully I'm not just recording stuff literally the day before it comes out, because that doesn't give me enough time to make sure that the quality's all up to stuff or do anything particularly fancy for editing. You know, and nothing short of, I don't know, a really inconveniently timed power outage could possibly mess me up after that point. Sure would suck if that happened. But the weather seems to be pretty clear here for the next week, so it probably won't. You know, I 
I'm getting a very strange feeling that that comment is gonna age poorly. Oh well, we'll see, right? Fight me, oh. random cultist. I need experience points. Uh, anyways, uh, what do you guys think of the intro and outros? I know they're not crazy fancy or anything. Why did my fusion meter just empty when it was full? I don't understand why it did that, or why it just does that sometimes. That's really weird. Uh, I don't know what to say about that. That's frustrating enough that it really knocked off my tempo there. Jormungold Gold is another monster that I really like the design of. I need to do some serious team building once I'm strong enough to explore more of the world. I love Jormungold's design, I really do, but the problem is since my starter is also a poison type, it's a little bit redundant to use both of them. And I mean, just like with Pokemon, there's nothing saying you have to use your starter on your team, but I'm going to, if for nothing else, because my Asmodeus, the final form of Malchemy, is really, really strong. Uh, speaking of monsters getting stronger, uh, Sirenade hit five star. So I'm going to sit at camp in order to get it to its remastered form because its stats should go up a whole heck of a lot. Oh, Dandelion was one fight off remastering. That's really, that bugs me. Man, other than Diveal, they're all close. Hey, look on the bright side. You know, either later this episode or maybe next episode, depending on how I cut up the footage and how much XP I earn, uh, those guys should get stronger too. So that'd be neat, huh? Now I just need to immediately remember where I'm going in the area I was just in because I have the memory of a goldfish. Uh, the bullet dash really does make moving around so much better. And you get more max stamina when you defeat the, the main bosses, so... I'll be able to use it for longer after I beat some of them. Hello, random guy. Yeah, yeah, good for you. Okay, uh, interesting theory. Let's see its execution. Look, I'm going to vanquish you. Sure you are, pal. Oh no, not taunt. Now I have to use damaging attacks to end the fight or something. Woe is me. Idiot. Aww. I always liked Kitelli. It is adorable. It's a cat and a television. The main downside with it is that, uh, you say, right? Electric monsters in this game offensively are amazing, but the problem is. Uh, the things they're weak to, they're really weak to. The negative effect uh, that electric types get when they're hit by stuff they're weak to is really bad. Why are there so many of you? And this really is just a whole full-on cult we got going on here, huh? You know, it's funny. Uh, normally, astral types are pretty great because they're uh, they're neg like they, they have positive matchups on so many things, but and their negative effects aren't usually a big deal. 
But on starter grade specifically, it really sucks for him because uh, this is a support type monster who uses lots of non-damaging moves and he just kind of can't when you hit him with poison and metal attacks. Also, starter grade gets like nothing for good attacking moves until it remasters. I mean, seriously, just like nothing usable. <sighs> and in the item box is a key. Man, I wonder what the key could unlock. I sure hope it's this gate conveniently right outside uh, from the house that had the key in it. Hello, person running in circles. <laughs> Uh, an important thing about the way this game works, by the way, is when you're hit by a attack from a monster that causes an effect on your monster, that is entirely applied even to your human character, so even switching monsters doesn't get rid of it. Which is good for if you're affected by a positive condition, but really bad if it's a negative condition. You know, you know what else would probably help me do a little bit better in some of these fights? If I ever put new moves on my guys. Because the fact that even after remastering into Decibel, Decibel still only has a couple of attacks, and they're not very strong ones either. Okay, plant type. I don't want to be in on water. Glossamaw is pretty neat. I really like the design of it, which is why I wanted to use one on my team for a while. That's what uh, Dandelion is going to remaster into, if you couldn't tell. I don't know why Decim... Or not Decimbello, we got it at Sirenade. But I don't know why Sirenade gets Provoke by level up, because it has awful defensive stats. So I don't see any reason it would want to be eating extra hits. I don't know. It seems a little counterproductive to me. Ooh, Icebreaker. That's a really strong move. That's good to have. Oh no, she thinks she's not good enough. Oh, I could be some kind of nice person and tell her otherwise, or I could say it like it is and say that she's awful. Well, gee, if you don't want to fight me on an empty stomach, why don't you just not? Nobody's making you fight me. Cold Story is a weird move, because it does damage, but the game classifies it as a as a status move. Which is weird, because that means I just don't know what attack stat it uses. Okay, Berserk's not the best effect to get for free. I mean, I guess Berserk won't let it use that, that coal attack again, since the game counts it as a status move. I hope this game gets more updates than just the one it's already got. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm, I'm thankful for the fact that they're doing post-launch content at all. But this game is really cool, and I really think it would be neat if it kept getting updated for a while to come. Though it is one of the top-rated games on Steam now, so I'm pretty sure it's going to keep getting updates. By the way, shameless plug for the company that doesn't pay me at all, obviously. The Steam Summer Sale is currently on. And on top of that, because of this game is half off, buy it. Support the devs. It's really good. Don't come back until you bought it. Okay, okay. Did you buy it and you're back now? Perfect. Okay, now finish the video so then I still get my good 
uh, YouTube statistics. But then after you're done doing that, go play through the entire game, 100% the game, get all the achievements, do all of the things, do it now. Do it or your family will disappear. I'm holding your family hostage and the only way to get them back is if you send me... And the game crashed. There goes my joke. We'll be back. And we're back. Uh, so after that game crash, I had to redo the entire dungeon. So that was great. Uh, oops, I almost forgot. Hang on. I had to use my upgrade. Uh, but on the bright side, uh, we're going to remaster some monsters now. You know, again, because I had to redo stuff. But it's okay. It's all taken care of. I really, really, really hate it when that kind of thing happens. Uh, so, pro tip, never leave anything else running in the background when you're trying to record a game. Generally not the best play. All right, there's Blossom Eye. He's pretty cool. And because it had ice coating and I forgot to take it off, it became the new version. Yay, number 122. I mean, that's fine. All right, so monsters are all really strong now. Now I just got to get good moves on them. Let's see, edit stickers. I know I have empty slots. What can I add? Sort. I don't have anything good. I need to go buy stickers. Hello, what do you have to say? Another landkeeper office. Good to know where those are. Hmm. What do you have today? You have garbage! Hmm. Actually, Metal Riff isn't bad. Alright, now we're going over to the other end of town, which has a loading screen for some reason. Because someone over here sells what I actually want. Not this house, wrong house. You know what? Wrong house still, but I'll get a free bootleg monster. Those are like shinies. That is truly an awful one, and because I didn't save first, I'm stuck with it. Disappointment 100. <laughs> Okay, here we are. Yeah, no, I don't need... Oh, no, no, that was the right one. Excuse me. Okay, let's see here. Yep. Want an energy shot. Hang on, I gotta actually make sure I have things set up. This is exactly what you came to see, right? Shopping and, uh, and move setting. Uh, let's see, I'm just gonna take Provoke off because it's awful on Decibel. Okay, let's see. Let's rearrange my moves. Energy shut. No, I didn't want to peel Sonic. I am not very good at doing this efficiently, am I? All right, there we go. Call for help is bad. Dodge is bad. I'll keep air wall though. What else do I have that I want? I'll take broadcast. I have some kind of... No, that's all I got. That's fine. That's all Decibel needs. Okay, let's check. No, not check me. Check Alchemy. Alchemy. I'm just going to reorder the stickers because this ordering is bugging me. Okay, 
bite is just whatever. All right, we'll keep chemical unbalanced there so it activates my good move. Sugar rush is good. I gotta check Blossom on his stats. Alright, ranged attack. Okay, so I wanna replace Smack with the ranged equivalent. But I don't have any. Okay, back to the shop! Yay, shopping! If I do this strategically enough, I might be able to do the thing where I stand in front of the boss fight and then don't do it because it's unfortunately time to end the video and you'll all be really angry with me and it'll be really funny. F f for me, not for you. Because you guys won't like that at all. You guys will be really annoyed. Spit. Defend is okay. Element walls okay. Leech is okay. That's good. Call for help is bad. Shield smack is good on Blossom because of its high defense. And we'll give it energy shots just so it has a improved attack option. Let's see, can you spit energy shot? Oh, no, I forgot. Shield bash. Leech. Snooze spore. Defend, raise shields, elemental wall. There. All Seer isn't very good. I'm not too worried about it until it remasters. Okay, need smack instead of spit. Ice coating is useless when it's already an ice type. I like Icebreaker. Uh, let's see, what else did I have set up here? There, just that, so I have a multi target option. Alright, that one's gonna be a little bit more basic, but. There, it's done. I'm set up for the boss fight. And if I'm timing this perfectly, which I think, bruh, you gotta be kidding me. Thank you, autosave. Glad I turned that back on, because we didn't lose anything this time. Uh, so that's just a thing that's going to be happening now after this update, I guess. That's great. Uh, I mean, I know I have a couple of quality of life mods installed, and those might be having conflicts with the new version, and I'll have to double check with that after today's recording session. But, uh, yeah. <coughs> oh boy, story moment. <laughs> Are you kidding me? That's the cult leader? He looks lame. I forgot how lame he was, because on my single-player file, this was the first Archangel I fought, just like this. Like, the Archangel that's down here. So, I just... <laughs> I forgot how lame he is. Yes, because the uh, serpent god is going to be great. I mean, th oh no! Yeah, oh no is right. Uh, are you even thinking? Are there any of these people thinking about this? Think about it, right? They're the Morn children, the the children of the Morning Star, and they're trying to find the serpent god buried beneath the earth. Y'all are looking for the devil. This is just like a cult cult. I'm sorry, but... Kaylee, honey. Seriously. Sorry. 
<sighs> yeah, good for you. There is an Archangel. Jacqueline? Yes. He's totally going to ascend to godhood, guys. It's going to work out so well <sighs> for him. Yep, the... The serpent god is going to bless the children of the morning star with divine power and definitely not betray and murder the heck out of them. Yeah. Okay. I'm ready. Go ascend. Huh? <laughs> okay. I mean, I'm the RPG protagonist, and you're not, so having me go first is definitely the safe call. Uh. No. Yeah, that sounds about right. Just instantly disintegrated. Okay, here we go. Boss fight time. This would be really exciting if there was, if I was not, you know, higher level than it. Accuracy up. What, does its moves have a missed chance? That's lame. Imagine having a missed chance. Couldn't be me. Okay. So what I need to do now is not hit the the uh, the forbidden fruit defense wall. Uh, like I said, it's it's it, man's is really just the devil. I don't have any non-damaging moves on Decibel that doesn't also damage it. An air wall is pretty useless against this guy. See, he attacks with astral and electric attacks. Uh, Diveberg is a safe switch. Okay, multi target. That's going to suck a little bit. just stalling out that wall because I know something bad happens if you hit it. Alright, there we go. Taken care of. We can actually play the video game again. That's pretty great, huh? Oh, and this is a good time to have a wall because he's got his ultimate attack ready. You know, the one that he used to just, uh, to just one shot. Oh, oh, that's just lovely. Revenge strike deleting my wall. Oh, and Diveberg is just insta-dead. That's cool. That, that was a lot of damage, gonna be honest. Well, at least we have fusion now, so that should make it easier. <laughs> that looks so dumb.
I don't like that attack because it makes me not play the video game. Hey, look on the bright side. We're getting a real boss fight this time that isn't just going to be done in one turn. Okay, being really weak to electricity probably wasn't my best idea. That's it. I'm just going to do it. I'm not waiting. Okay, it's just poison. It doesn't even really matter. Leech is very good. Oh, if I went first, I should have used a shield. What am I doing? Never mind. Doesn't even matter. It didn't even do much. Okay. Yeah, I can take another turn to attack. This song is really good. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest, I think this fight's over though, because I'm pretty sure the leech damage is just gonna kill him. No, I outspeed. Take no further steps than you have towards me. You'll see it's the same old story. Man, I love this song. It's so good. Buy the soundtrack too. Uh, yeah, I remember earlier, I, right, I was threatening you and your family. Yeah, that's it. That's what I was doing. Now I remember. Uh, buy the game, 100%. It. Buy the soundtrack. Do it now. That's the only way your family will be safe. I'm threatening you. This is a threat. For the record, YouTube, this is this is fake. I'm joking. I've not kidnapped anyone's family. Uh, please do not ban me. Wow, yeah, great. Thanks, Morgante. Really great song piece there. It's one extra lyric. Hmm. Behold! Triangle! <laughs> Gotta catch them all, Pokemon. The understandable reaction. <laughs> we just struggle with that guy for ages. And then Triangle Guy's like, ooh, I'll take that, please. Dorian. Well, that's a delayed reaction. He got vaporized like a while ago. Sorry. Yeah, uh, maybe don't worship the, uh, the literal devil? That is probably not the one to pick. Gonna be real. Just, uh... I don't know, man. Doesn't seem like the play to me, you know what I mean? Come on, why is there no be mean and double down option? Whatever, I'll just say something nice then, I guess, because I'm expected to be a good person. Crazy.
And that's Kaylee's quest line done. You know, that would have been useful to have earlier. Uh, if you didn't know fusion power, which of course you don't know. Fusion power is just a 10 energy attack with like the highest base power in the game usually and a really good added effect. It's like a Z move from Pokemon. Hmm. That's right. Triangle guy. I know his name. You don't get to know his name yet, though. He's tr you just get to know he's triangle guy and he's a jerk. All right, I probably recorded way too much footage for one video already anyway, so I'm just gonna save the game and uh, stop the recording now. So, uh... Perfect outro, bye. All right, thanks for watching. Today's comment question of the day is, what's your favorite pet? Uh, obviously, cat and dog are the two normal choices that most people would pick from, but I want to hear from you what your favorite animal to own as a pet is. Anyways, thanks for watching.